Hello, Father James Kubicki here with some words from Pope Francis and the prophet Isaiah. Today, on the first Sunday of Advent, we begin a new liturgical year. The Lord tells us through the prophet Isaiah, It shall come to pass in the latter days that the mountain of the house of the Lord shall be established as the highest of the mountains and shall be raised above the hills, and all the nations shall flow to it, and many peoples shall come and say, Come, let us go up to the mountain of the Lord, to the house of the God of Jacob, that he may teach us his ways and that we may walk in his paths. They shall beat their swords into plowshares and their spears into pruning hooks. Nation shall not lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war any more. What a beautiful day it shall be when weapons are dismantled in order to be transformed into tools for work. What a beautiful day that shall be, and this is possible. Let us bet on hope, on the hope for peace, and it will be possible. The season of Advent, which we begin again today, restores this horizon of hope, a hope which does not disappoint, for it is founded on God's word, a hope which does not disappoint simply because the Lord never disappoints. He is faithful. He does not disappoint. Let us think about and feel this beauty. The model of this spiritual disposition, of this way of being and journeying in life, is the Virgin Mary, a simple girl from the country who carries within her heart the fullness of hope in God. In her womb, God's hope took flesh. It became man. It became history, Jesus Christ. Let us allow ourselves to be guided by her during this season of active waiting and watchfulness.